In Acts 3, Peter and John heal a man who is lame and word of it spreads fast. As people began to gather in awe, Peter used this opportunity to preach Jesus. But he was preaching to the very people who condemned Jesus to death. The people that up to this point were glad that Jesus had been executed. Now they stood astonished, amazed that the very name of Jesus is still healing people. It's in this moment that Peter reminds them of their sin and their part in the crucifixion. Then surprisingly, he offers them hope. He invites them into the kingdom of God. And here is the message he gave them in verse 19. Now repent of your sins and turn to God so that your sins may be wiped away. If you think about it, who better to give this message than Peter? The man who denied Christ three times is now sharing the same grace Jesus showed him. That's all we're called to do, to share the grace of God that he's extended to us. And not only does he wipe away our sins, listen to the promise of hope of new life in Jesus in verse 20. Then times of refreshment will come from the presence of the Lord, and he will again send you Jesus, your appointed Messiah.